This is the new PlayStation VR 2 with one wire connection, so it's much easier than the old one, 4K HDR visuals with a 110 degree field of view. We are going to unbox this and try it out. And there's cats in the background. Being psychos. Fancy dart, help me out. <laughs> oh no. <gasps> there, did it. The little sticker in the box kept getting in the way. Ugh. Whatever. Put it over there. Be gone. That was fast. I put the box on the ground and the cat just instantly went in it. No delay. Hey, don't mess up the box. <laughs> All right, so comes with the wires. This uh, little USB to USB-C to charge the new controllers. Some high quality headphones, but I'm pretty sure you can use your own too if you want. Yeah, they're just normal. You can use your own headphones too if you want. And it said you can use any Bluetooth or wired headphones that work with PS5 already. Our little instruction manual. That's all that's in there. And here's what we're looking for. Ooh. Ooh, it's very light. It's much lighter than the old one, and the old one was already super light. Oh, look at it. Who got the headset? It looks nice. It has like a, I don't know if you can see that. It has like a springy silicone face pad now instead of just the silicone one from before. Ooh, it's all like springy. Like there's an air pocket in there. That's nice. Put that down. And then all that should be left is the controllers. The new DualSense controllers. Nope, that's it. Let's get these babies open. Nope. No! Stop it! Cats are crazy. So these are a huge upgrade from the old ones, because the old PlayStation VR controllers were literally just the Move controllers from the PS3. And don't get me wrong, they worked really well, but these ones were made from the ground up. For VR. Those old ones were not. And yet they still did amazing. Like I love my PlayStation VR. It's just it just sucks to set up. Ooh, it's very comfortable. Much more comfortable than the Oculus. At least so far. So here we got them. They look crazy. So these have the, hap the new haptics that the PS5 controllers have. How is this gonna get on? How do you... Oh, you put it through like this. So it has the haptics, like the 3D sense or whatever that the DualSense controllers for the PS5 have. So you'll have much better vibration, high quality. The triggers, L2 and R2, have force feedback. Their example was if you're drawing a bow with the, um, in Horizon Forbidden West? What is the new one? The new Horizon game for the VR. If you draw the bow with it, you'll feel the tension in both the trigger tightening up and 
the vibration coming from the controllers. These are very comfortable. I'm excited to use them. We're gonna be trying the Horizon demo for this. Uh, the headset itself is only a one wire connection, which I'm super excited about because the old one took a lot to set up, but it was very comfortable and it was still a very good headset. I prefer it more than the Oculus, but the Oculus has it beat with simplicity. Not anymore. Now we just plug it directly into the front of the PlayStation and we're off. So there's no more camera set up. It has built-in tracking right inside of the headset. It has a microphone. It has vibration built into the headset for another level of immersion. Um, you can, the eyes, the eyeglasses, you can, adjust the eye distance for better comfort and viewing. There's a few more things. I don't know. I'm super excited. Let's play. Cat causing trouble. So, you either take your chances with us or... Stormbird. Stormbird? We haven't come this far to get struck by lightning. Oh. All right, I think we're clear. That's freaking dope. So, I'd better head to Don's grasp, find Marad, see what he wants in return for a pardon. Oh, I can grab this. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's a weird way. Fine. Uh, uh, hey, I want a finger paint. <gasps> well, I drew a dick. I didn't mean to draw a dick, but I drew a dick. I don't know why I always make things harder for myself. I did this in Resident Evil when I tried it to be R2. on fire <gasps> what happened did the fire nation attack Don's grasp. it's on fire I better get over there see if anyone's still alive 